Caught on camera, surveillance video shows an inmate attacking a sheriff's deputy in the jail. But it was the quick actions of another inmate that probably saved that deputy's life. Fox's Gloria Gomez has the story. A female detention deputy at the Falkenberg jail has no idea what's about to happen. Armed with a pillowcase and shank, a female inmate is planning a sneak attack. You see other inmates run over, including inmate Mary Jean, who jumps into action. She said that she saw the deputy's feet in the air and she had to jump in as quick as she could and that there was possibly a shank that she saw in the moment. Attorneys Denita Kolev and Rick Escobar represent Mary Jean. She didn't do this to help herself in her current legal situation. She did this as, uh, you know, as an aid to humanity to help this deputy. Court records show inmate Bridget Harvey and co-defendant April Colvin plotted an escape plan. They created a ruse that inmate Colvin was sick and lured the deputy into the bathroom where Harvey would assault the deputy and take her keys to escape the pod. It shows that she really is a good person. And this wasn't the first time Mary Jean has come to the rescue of a detention deputy. She did it five months earlier. She did uh, jump in again when a different inmate had attacked the deputy while she was on her computer. Inmate Stephanie Camera is now charged with battery of a law enforcement officer and resisting with violence. As for Mary Jean, she's still locked up with a broken hand, a combat wound for doing the right thing that got the attention of the sheriff. And I heard through the grapevine was speaking to my client that she got a pizza party and some recognition. <laughs> and this time around, I think she was able to get a Coca-Cola, so she was really excited about it. Gloria Gomez, Fox News.